Come on, come on, come on! Welcome back to Gunslinger TV. I'm Houston Adams. I'm Clark Adams. And we're at ECBC, 21st Emerald, Annual Emerald, Emerald Coast, Coast Blue Marlin Wolf. Classic. So we're excited. We're ready. We're heading to the pass right now for the shotgun start. It starts at 12. It's 1030. So we got a little bit. We're going to ease over there. Uh, what do you want? I want a 700 at least. It's going to take an 8 to win. I take a 7 at least. If we get a 7, I'll be happy. Really, just tuna and some marlin we're not worried about all the catch and release this trip so it's just strictly kill fish so we'll see what happens we'll see y'all out there all right we got 30 more minutes 11 30 we're just waiting can't be i mean i wish it'd just go go ahead and be 12 o'clock Wish we could just snap our finger at 12. guys it is 9 30 almost it's we're cold. at some drill ship right now if y'all are wondering what happened something. to my face if this y'all wondering what happened uh while i was wiring the shark we're trying to break it off and the shark jumped out of the water and it of course it popped in it came back and hit me across the face but i'm all right if y'all if y'all care but i really haven't heard of any any billfish other than our friends nikki bella i think they caught a Selfish. Selfish, I think. They got a Wahoo. We got over here, got our baits pretty quick, put our baits out, had a bite, there was a shark, put them back out. I'm pretty sure we had a real nice tuna. Instantly after. 
like first bait in the water, dropped, freaking ate it out the rigger, popped the rigger, there he is, got her on. Then about- We caught it for, we caught it for a pretty good minute, probably 15 minutes, 20 minutes, and it was coming up, slowly coming up. Doing her nice little tuna thumps, and then came up about the main line to the leader at the knot, was about 50 yards under the boat, it was right there, and then freaking doinked her off. Pulled the hook. She pulled the hook, so nothing we really could have done there, but we, we did have our blue marlin hooks. Yeah. We got our little tuna hooks out now, but yeah. I mean, a little, little bumpy out here right now. It's supposed to clear up, I think about two o'clock when we start catching bait. Two, four, two to four is gonna be a lot, a lot nicer than it's been, but we're gonna eat dinner. We may try to tuna fish tonight. If not, we'll see y'all in the morning. It is 9.40 right now. It's been a little slow. They caught their bait. How long did it take? 25 minutes. It's been slow. It looks like some rain's coming in right now. Kind of crazy. It dropped about six degrees. Feels a lot better out here, but we're just waiting for a bite. We just had a good mark. We'll see what happens. We're deep, but it, it's a good bite, real good bite, so I'll be easy with her and get her up there and see what it is. Tuna flyer. No, he can't hear you, Clark. Four for three. Coming up. Where's the rope? Where's the rope? Here, I got you, I got you. Hold on. Here. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Give me your tail. Give me your tail. Come on, come on, come on! Yeah, I'm that! Let's take a picture real quick. 
100%. When you go a day and a half without getting a real bite, and then it's a fish like that, yeah, it'll it'll change everyone's attitude. Welcome back, guys. We're uh, day two, and it is. 10 14 a night we are drifted off from the rig right now we just got done eating dinner and as y'all saw we caught a big old tuna so we're everyone's super excited about that we're all fired up i mean i mean that's a great tuna we needed that tuna after we dunked off that one yesterday everybody was like oh dang we're not gonna get another bite but we did so we capitalized got it done we got tomorrow we may go back over to the rig tonight, I'm not sure. Do you know anything about that? Uh, I think Kevin said we're gonna pull up and try to pull a couple chunks, but put out some of these hardtails that we have and try to catch some more big tuna like that one. But yeah, we, we hooked up on a nice, nice hardtail. Uh, it, that's what we caught that tuna on. So, I'm gonna go back over to the rig, tuna fish, see if we can catch another big one. I doubt we'll catch one like that, chunking, but we'll catch a 130 maybe. But yeah, we're everyone's great, everyone's happy, everyone's full. <laughs> but tomorrow, expecting big blue marlin. I mean, that's all we can hope for tomorrow. We got we got our tuna. Blue marlin's all we need tomorrow. Just a big old 700 pounder. Yeah. Right now, there's only uh, 111 got weighed in today, but it, oh, it, it got, got disqualified. De got dequeued actually. So the, yeah. Uh, it hit the prop. Prop ran it over and disqualified it. So that one's out. And then a smaller tuna got weighed in today, uh, 119. But we definitely got that beat. Right now, technically, that's first place, but I'm... Unofficially yeah, first place. I'm, I'm, I'm sure we got first place. That's what I feel like right now. It's a, she's real thick. She gets girth all the way to her tail. I can barely pick her up. But we'll see y'all in the morning. <laughs> 